My name is Julie Grant. I've been a musician since 1988. I write songs because I've got something to say and I want people to hear them and I enjoy singing. In the mid-90s when I was doing a lot of acoustic stuff then, the BBC preferred acoustic stuff because you could just plug in and play. It happened quite by accident that we became an acoustic trio. There's a bigger scene and more scope for acoustic artists and there's a need for it. I'm not that enamoured by the North East scene to be honest. The just general awful attitude of, of musicians. You know, they don't support other local bands and then they whinge on that they're not being noticed. Unfortunately I find now as well that a lot of people don't go to gigs as much as they used do. It's refreshing to have a band like the Violet Bunnies who are interested in the local scene, are interested in what other people are doing and are quite happy to promote it and be part of this, what should be a camaraderie. They obviously care about the scene very much and want to be part of it and want to celebrate it with other artists such as myself. Chris, she started to follow me online, sent positive comments back and somebody worth sort of listening to and I, that I had something to say. Well, if you like me, then you must be sort of on the same wavelength. I saw the Violet Bunnies at um, their single launch and liked what I heard. I thought the originals were, were very well constructed. Is it grass? I look forward to hearing it. They had a very full sound, they didn't have bass or drums but I felt like they didn't need it. The vocal harmonies worked very well. And they did put some covers in but they did the covers in their own way with their own stamp on it. I've invited them to play at our album launch on the 9th of August at Bar Loco in Newcastle. Um, Julie Grant is back again. It's me but it's us. And the it's out on the 9th of August, the CD launch. It's me, but it's us, we're on the cover. We've deliberately made it acoustic to show that there is an acoustic scene up here and it fits in with, you know, what we're about, the acoustic trio. It's what they hear is what they see, which is what they get.